such a beautiful finish. Hey, good morning, everybody. Jen Carvasi, Jekyll Bates. We're starting off with this little guy this morning on the shop update. Going out the door on this holographic foiled lipless in that winter green pattern. Seven more to show you, so let's get into those. We're going to start with this Nolan's Crawl. Gold, little copper flake, plum pearl, cool eyes. These eyes are, I want to say these eyes are from Dinger, these particular ones. They come on, um, I'll show you guys here, five and six millimeter, and that's what they look like on the sheet. Very, very pretty eyes. And they kind of have a little color shift deal going on. These pearl eyes we're going to feature here in just a second. Just to give you guys an idea of what kind of eyes we use here at Jekyll. But yeah, just a, a very pretty presentation. And this is that new lot KBS Diamond Clear. The new and improved. Had zero troubles with it. And it is absolutely lasting a ton longer. Uh, without skinning over. These are two T Rocks crawls going out to Steve. Finally got these guys back in. And that plum, a little bit of dark on the edges. Those eyes that you guys just saw. And then a fluorescent orange on the belly. Very cool little deal. And then these uh, just variated eyes. On, on these particular eyes, and you can get them at AliExpress, um, they are not the same. So you're not going to get two eyes that are exactly alike. You'll get them close. Um, but they're, they're beautiful. It's freshwater pearl. And they complement baits very, very well. They come in 5 and 6 millimeters. They may come in other sizes. I haven't seen them in other sizes. But just a super, super bait. I love getting close and personal with these baits to show you exactly what you're getting. You're going to see if there's any bubbles on here. You're going to see if there's flaws. And uh, I'm just loving, loving, loving this finish. And the paint as well. This is a hand detail. I do the hand detail with these guys after the fact. Just to add a little bit of something different on that crawl pattern. And the crawl pattern, uh, the stencil here is an old Jonas Summers from Lure Color Studios out of Australia. So I like to feature his stuff every once in a while. Um, I haven't seen him very active lately, but definitely, uh, definitely something to go, go look at his videos on YouTube on Lure Color Studio. Just an amazing artist. I hope he's still doing it. It's Jonas, if you're out there, hey, what's up? This is that hot red crawl. A little bit of orange on the belly, but mostly just to fade up into some dark red. Very popular this time of year through post-spawn. I hope you guys are getting out and fishing. Um, fishing has been deemed an essential function in very many states. Uh, a lot of the interior states, Texas, we are in Arkansas. It's, I mean, because think about it. If people aren't working right now and your pay is limited or non-existent, um, and, and this, this goes without saying, I'll, I'll go so far as to say this, there's families that I know that would not eat if they didn't hunt or fish. So it has to be an essential, uh, deal. Just make sure you're following laws and regulations and state creel limits and stuff like that. Um, and be careful when you're out there as always, um, you should be anyways, every day. It's common sense. Um, just employ the common sense that that's God given in all of us. <laughs> Um, and we'll get through this. We'll get all, we'll get all better. I hope. Um, the Marines say that hope is not a plan of action. Uh, I was in the army, not a Marine. Um, it's, it is what it is, folks. We gotta, we gotta get back at it. Hot sticks crawl. Red discus. blue veins. This is the mesh. A lot of you guys comment that uh, I use the mesh quite a bit in my videos and I do, but I just, it's, it produces such cool patterns. Look at this stuff, folks. This is, this is a beautiful pattern. 
Love it. Some of my coolest stuff come off of mesh baits. And pretty much all this is is laying down a, a darker color as your primer. Um, I did white to coat it first and then I laid down that Maui blue and then meshed it after it was heat set. And these are the results that you get. Just phenomenal, beautiful, beautiful stuff. And then we have this rotten strawberry, which keeps evolving, morphing. Fun pattern. These are definitely dinger eyes. Unfortunately, um, I'm waiting on a bigger shipment. Hopefully he'll have a bigger shipment of S cranks coming in soon because I would much prefer to use his. So uh, I can give you props on the eyes on this one, but I'm down to my old, old, old stuff with the S cranks. <laughs> You know, they swim okay. I mean, they're, they're not horrible, but I just, I love, I love Brian's stuff better. Sorry. It's just, it's just a better, better pressing, better weighted, better balanced. These are good as well. So that is what I got for you guys this morning. I got to clean these up, get them out the door. I hope you guys have a fantastic rest of your week, day, morning, evening, night, whenever it is you guys are watching this video. And thanks as always for hanging out with me on the channel. It's always good to see you guys. Leave me some comments. I'm going to be doing a spray session. I might kick it out to you guys again as far as what you want to see. Um, I would exclude bluegill, craw, and crappie. Anything else under the sun you guys want to see me spray this weekend, let me know in the comments below and have a fantastic day. Cheers and happy casting from Jekyll Bates.